In case you didn't know, I am a hardcore TweetBot user. I use it all the time. It's my favorite Twitter app for iOS. But this little black splash screen that loads up when you first load up TweetBot or when you just launch it after it's been launched gets on my nerves. I hate that little box there because it, it takes like a second away from my, my TweetBot experience. And of course, if you kill the app, you relaunch it, you get the black splash screen again. But that's just the nature of the beast on iOS. There is no true backgrounding on iOS until now. That is because this is a jailbreak tweet called Background Manager that allows you to have true backgrounding on iOS. And there's a lot of features here. You have the global feature, which globally changes all the options. Of course, you can enable backgrounding globally, but that's probably not very good for this right here, the battery of life. So I wouldn't recommend doing that. Probably want to keep it on native for the global mode. But the nice thing about this is the each app option. This allows you to select specific apps that you want to enable backgrounding for. So you can just add an item just like that. Choose your item from the list. I've already have my favorite item here. It is TweetBot, of course, and I'm going to show you how to configure that for true backgrounding on iOS. So just select background right here, and that's true backgrounding, folks. You can choose none, background, or you can choose native if you want to do that. Uh, but we're going to talk about background here, and I want to focus on some specific settings down below. You probably have already spied them out. You see enable at launch is already on. And then the auto launch feature, that is awesome. So you can launch when boot or install. So you can auto launch this uh, when booting your device and also auto relaunch. You can relaunch when the app is exited. So this basically is like, seriously, it is like auto start or auto login. So I started the app the initial time and now you see every time I launch it from this point forward, backgrounding is enabled. I'm gonna kill the app right now. Watch how quick it loads up when I launch it this time. So let's see what happens here. The black splash screen is there for a split second. It is gone just like that. This is an awesome jailbreak tweak, folks. So now I'm going to respring my device and see if it will auto launch upon respring. So let's go ahead and try it out. There's TweetBot. Bam, loads up just like that. So it's automatically running once you respring or reboot your device courtesy a background manager. This really is an awesome tweak. It is 99 cents on Cydia's Big Boss repo. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.